are we on? Hello everyone. So, today is a very special landmark for St. Cross. As today, he is going to get Switch Class 5. Um, he was supposed to get it during an XP run, but didn't quite make it, apparently. So what is Switch 5? What are these Switch systems um, and what is this constellation that you're looking at at the moment? So this is actually very similar to Switch 4, where again, you have to um, fill up these, you know, these nodes with the appropriate amount of um, token item. So this one is, you know, for this branch, you got the Flame Crest. This one, you have the Agatha Orb. And the third branch would be the Coyotus Mask. And you need increasingly, uh, an increasing, you know, you'll need to fill this up with an increasing number of tokens. It starts off with 10 and then across and then progressively gets more. Um, requires more and more up to the last part where it need, you need 18 of those, um, so, you know, souls or nodes filled up. Um so the best way to dupe this, I'm going to make a, a video about how to grind XP, you know, um, effectively uh, in another video. But for now, let's just pretend you know how to how to do that. Um, and we are at the last node, so we need only two more. Um, and the reason why you know I wanted to bring this up also is to explain that. Um, you're probably saying 0 over 10. That's because I've, I'm already done with this. These are all lit up. This one is not. So this is. you can see that this is slightly darker, so I'm on this last node. You uh, you could redeem this using the... Uh, buying them directly from the store. Or you could... Um, I'm sorry. You can redeem this by using your XP. Right? So if I go back to my... <coughs> excuse me. My main interface... You can see that I'm at 9.44%. Um, right here. That's how, how, how many XP I've got. And if I actually wait, <clears throat> maybe um, around lunchtime, I should have enough. If you guys are willing to wait with me in this video for about three or four hours. <laughs> um, but we're not going to do that. Just kidding. So let's go to Switch, switch Class 5. I'm going to show you how to redeem it. So if you redeem it, um your xp goes down like just like switch five. Oh, but i can't because i don't have enough so it needs 1.37 just a tad bit more what happens is it uses that xp and then puts it into you know just puts it into this node here so your xp will literally go back from 9.5 down to 0 0.0 something um and the the more xp that you get the you know the more obviously the more um the more of those tokens you can redeem um, unlike Switch 4, though, if you're not careful, like if you're really after getting Switch 5 and not after the levels, you might level up, just like what I did. Um, so I wasn't paying attention one one day, and I leveled up to 131, because apparently you can. Unlike in Switch 4, when you hit the, the maximum number of Know, maximum ex, uh, experience points. You're, that's as far as it's going to go. It's not going to let you proceed any further. So yeah, um, with Switch 5, you have the option to either switch or continue leveling. Let me show you. So for the level ranking, you see Red Horse and Crabart are both already at a higher, much higher level than I am. And this is a good contrast uh, comparison how much how much uh, how many levels uh, are you gonna miss out on if you switch if you if you go straight to uh, filling up your switch you know those those souls those nodes in your switch system and you can see that uh, he is already one um, 14 levels legend levels ahead of me because I was actually ahead of him by uh, two or three levels and because i went to this you know to pursue this um he's now in the lead by double digits <laughs> uh, now that's the benefit if you don't switch you get more levels you get more 
talent skills right here right so that's that's one of the benefits second benefit is you get to do higher higher level content stuff faster um, what I mean by that is if you go to the boss ruins you hit 200 straight away um, then you you get to do those first if you in the uh, chaos if you hit 190 first then you got the chaos ghost dumb area all to yourself um, the the divine ruins uh, if you hit level 160 first then you're not gonna be in an environment that has as many players so you can pretty much farm or do your you know do your bounty bosses uh, without any stress um, yeah that's those are the benefits you get you know you get to access high level content faster and you get to um, your, your talent skills uh, you get uh, more talent skills than someone who would pursue the switch class now what's in it for the switch class though for those people players who do the switch class you get to uh, progress your character further because once you switch once you complete the switch class you now unlock the voyage or for your curio you unlock the gen 5 wings and the trans transmutation for that I'm sorry this says transmo that's transmogrification um, you unlock your advanced class avatar and you get higher level XP uh, I'm sorry higher le higher level daily and guild quests um, most importantly you get to equip the level 12 gears so in general you might be stronger um, might have a higher damage output uh, performance compared to someone who doesn't switch who's already at a higher level so yeah let's go ahead and do and since I'm impatient, right, I don't really want to wait for this to fill up. Um, I, I did everything else by filling up the XP, or as you notice, I've, I've, I've really trailed, got left behind in XP. So let's just go ahead and do the obtain now. Obtain now, and, and this is one big difference between Switch 5 and Switch 4. Switch 5 will only allow you to purchase from the common item store unlike in switch 4 you could bypass that by spending bound diamonds see nothing here which is why I prefer to go down the XP route and since I only need two I can do that definitely just got you know I just have to there you go so I've got two that's awaken 26,210 increase in CP for just for that node <laughs> that would have been really funny if all I got for switch to you know for switch 5 was like 20,000 combat points um, but yeah for each node you get about that much CP increase because you get these stats added to your base um, let's complete the switch uh, what happened I speak as if I know what's going on all right. Okay, so master, don't go. No, that's my partner. There's a quest. All right. I thought there was an additional quest. Now is the time for the stars to witness her glory. I vow to the companion of spirits and to build myself up, in order to protect the weak and uphold justice. We will fight to our death until the dark demons are com completely eliminated. May the bright starlight guide us on our way, and may EO Games gain a lot of money from my wallet hereby Boom. so I am now a what is that silvery ranger so I get tw 291,600 CP that's not the point um, the point is you get more you know you get these gears you get to equip gear 12 items so let's see and I do have I think I do have some something in storage that for the life of me I couldn't um, couldn't figure out why I couldn't equip it uh, let's sort this out there it is I could not equip this before well not equip right you could use 
Yeah, activate rather. You don't equip them, you activate them. I get 2% attack and 9% E. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. 1 point. What? What? I didn't see it. <laughs> Was it 1.8? Yay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, finally. Can try catching up with you now. Alright, so switch five gives you the number five the Roman numeral five on your badge. And that's it. That is it. Did we get anything as special? Um, what is that? <laughs> no, it's not anything special. Artifact boxes. Yeah, that's everything. So, um,. We're good to go. Cheers.